Are you looking for the TOP5 Best Cordless Drill? In this video, we will look at some of the TOP5 Best Cordless Drill on the market. For more details and price click product link please check the description below. Before we get started with our video, number 1. Makita FD7 Ron 12V Brushless Cordless Driver Drill Kit One of the first things we noticed about the Makita drill was its lightweight, compact size, making it well suited for smaller jobs. At just 6.5 inches long and 2.3 pounds, with an ergonomic grip to boot, the drill fits comfortably into tight spots where many others won't. Makita's brushless motor makes the most of the 12 volts of lithium-ion battery power, which is plenty for everyday tasks, such as drilling holes to hang pictures. We started with a fully charged battery and inserted a paddle bed. The drill comes with two power settings, and we selected the lowest to have sufficient torque for drilling through our test wood. We drilled dozens of holes and then switched to a hole saw bed. The 12-volt 2-amp-hour battery didn't start to show signs of exhaustion for a full 35 minutes of drilling. Keep in mind that we were drilling holes repeatedly, which put more pressure on the drill than is typical for most situations, so battery run times are understandably reduced. We then swapped in a fresh battery and inserted a driver bed. The compact Makita comes with a 20-setting clutch, so we tested the various torque settings to the screws we were using. This little Makita has slightly less power and torque than the 18-volt and 20-volt models we tested, yet it was surprisingly powerful for a 12-volt cordless drill. Though it is not a cheap cordless drill, it delivers decent battery life and superior balance, making it well-suited for most DIY projects. Number 2. Black Plus Decker 20 VMAX Cordless Drill Slash Driver LDEX 120C we discovered that we didn't have to spend a lot of money to get a powerful cordless drill. Few brands have a better reputation for balancing quality and value than Black and Decker, and their 20 VMAX cordless drill is a great example. After charging the battery, we started with a hole saw bit and drilled 2 inch holes in pine. The Black and Decker provided nearly as much power as the more expensive drills in this lineup, but it didn't have quite as much torque when we exerted a lot of pressure. Not a worry, it's not designed for heavy duty drilling, it's intended for basic around the house drilling and driving, and it does that exceptionally well. We tried a variety of bits, and the black end, Decker handled all but the largest auger bed. The battery went out around the 25 minute mark, so we paused to recharge. With the battery charged again, we switched to driver mode and inserted the screwdriver bit stored on the back of the tool's handle. The drill offers an 11 setting clutch, which allows us to tweak the drill's torque sensitivity when inserting screws. While this drill will not be powerful enough for a professional framer, it has ample power for many jobs around the home and yard, yet the price is among the lowest on the market. Even though the brush motor helps keep the cost down, Black and Decker didn't skimp on features in this lightweight ergonomic drill. An LED work light facilitates jobs in dark corners, and a 1.5 amp hour battery and a charger complete the kit. Number 3. Dual 20 VMAX Brushless Impact Driver and Drill This DeWall combo kit may appeal to both dyers and professionals. The cordless hammer drill makes light work of drilling into tough materials like masonry. The impact driver effortlessly deals with oversized fasteners like deck screws that can sap the energy from even the most powerful standard drill slash driver. We tested the DeWalt hammer drill on concrete and were impressed by its torque and power. We drilled more than a half a dozen holes without the hammer drill bogging down or the battery lagging. Our hands and wrists gave out before the hammer drill did its 20-volt 4-amp-hour battery just kept going and going. One slight downside is that the included leverage bar is made from relatively lightweight plastic it's okay but feels cheap. We attached it to the drill but ended up taking it off and using it without it. The impact driver is impressive. It comes with a compact nose and three speed adjustments. We inserted screws into soft pine without the impact motion kicking in. But when we added pressure and started inserting screws into ash, the impact motion kicked in and added power to insert the screws more quickly. The impact is smooth and rapid like a well-oiled machine. Like the hammer drill, the battery power of the driver lasted longer than we did. All in all, it's an excellent set for the money. The drill has a one 2 inch chuck with a durable all-metal 11 position clutch. The impact driver delivers high torque and 3,600 impacts per minute for consistent fast driving of even the largest fixings. Despite their power, each tool weighs in at just 3.4 pounds. Number 4. Makita DF12 DSC 7.2V Cordless Driver Drill Kit The standout feature of the 7.2V Makita Cordless Driver Drill Kit is its unique hinge body. Dyers can secure it in a pistol grip like a drill or inline like an electric screwdriver. Since most cordless drills come with a pistol grip, we were anxious to discover what, if any, benefits the cylindrical grip offered. With a fully charged battery, we started our test with the pistol grip and a small pal bit with a hex shank. It doesn't accept round shank bits, which is a bit of a downside. Since the Makita is a 7.2 volt drill slash driver, we didn't expect it to have as much power as other models we tested. Sure enough, it didn't, but it's not designed to rival a professional 20 volt drill. It's made to drill holes mostly in wood or drywall, and it does that quite well. 
the most significant benefit we found with the inline grip came when we needed to insert fasteners in tight spots, such as installing cabinet slides or hinges. Here's where the inline grip really makes a difference. It doubles as a cordless screwdriver but with more power. Its 21 setting clutch allowed us to select just the right amount of torque sensitivity for inserting various fasteners before it disengaged. We were also able to choose from two speeds, which increased versatility. We decided if we were going to have only one drill slash driver in the house for hand and tie tasks, we'd choose this Makita model. It's not a construction drill but it excels at reaching fasteners in tight spots. We could get nearly 30 minutes out of the drill before the battery ran out and we needed to recharge. The LED light doesn't just provide illumination. It also flashes when the battery charge gets low. Number 5. Milwaukee Mateen Fuel 1 slash 2 and Hammer Drill Milwaukee's cordless hammer drill offers the kind of heavy-duty performance that, until relatively recently, only corded drills could deliver. We could choose between drilling, driving, or hammer functions from the multifunction collar. The 14-setting clutch gave us the ability to select just the right sensitivity. When we switched between large fasteners in hardwood and smaller fasteners in pine, and the 1-slash-2-inch chuck reflects the tool's versatility and battery power. The optional support arm is plastic and steel, but it's pretty rugged. And because this drill comes with a lot of torque, we appreciated being able to help control it with the support arm. If the drill had jammed when we were using it, it didn't. The high torque could have resulted in a painful wrist injury. The Milwaukee handled virtually every test we threw its way. We drilled with a large auger bit, a 1-inch pal bit, a 2-inch hole saw bit, and we used it to drive fasteners in hardwood, in pine, and through sheet metal. This product is available as a tool only, so the kit doesn't include a battery or a charger. We used a well-worn 5.0 amp-hour 18-volt battery from another cordless tool, and we were able to get almost an hour of continuous use. With a new 5.0 amp-hour or a 6.0 amp-hour battery, this cordless drill would be more of a powerhouse than many dyers need.